Well, for many of us, Christmas just wouldn't be Christmas without Hallmark Christmas movies. And not even COVID-19 can take that from us. So what's the latest movie about? Well, take a look. Squire Rushnell and Louise Duart are well known for their popular Godwink books that were produced as record-breaking Hallmark Christmas movies. A Godwink Christmas was one of Hallmark Movies and Mystery Channel's all-time most viewed movies, garnering over 12.5 million viewers. A Godwink Christmas Meant for Love was ranked by IMDb among the top 10 Hallmark Christmas movies of the decade. Their latest, A Godwink Christmas, First Loves, Second Chances. I just came to get some vegetables and I read, now you must be John and PJ. You know, your dad and I have known each other since we were about one year older than John is now. It premieres on the Hallmark Movies and Mysteries channel on November 22nd. Well, please welcome back to the 700 Club, our dear friends, that amazing team, Squire Rushnell and Louise <laughs> Duard. It's great to have you with us today. Hello, Terry. Hi, Hello. Terry, Miss P. <laughs> well, congratulations on another of your Godwink stories making it into the Hallmark Channel movie. Was that a Godwink in itself? Yes, absolutely. The whole thing is a Godwink, the Godwink <laughs> of... Uh, of connecting with people. You know, we are divinely aligned with people all through life. We are in the right place at the right time. And when we when we look back and we say, gee, if I had just been there five minutes earlier, I wouldn't have met this woman that I was going to marry. <laughs> and so that was a God wink, whenever that divine alignment happens. Yes. And so we're seeing it played out out on Hallmark movies and those are all true stories and so that really excites us an awful lot. Well this is the third movie based on your Godwink series so what was the response to the first two? Oh it was amazing yeah you know what I think people are so longing for is that kind of coming together again as a family as people loving one another. And that's what God Wink movies do. They bring people together. God divinely aligns us. It really is, you know, in, in Proverbs 3, 6, it says, in all your ways, acknowledge me and I'll direct your paths. And God so gently directs us to the people he wants us to be with. We're on his GPS, God's positioning system. We just need to acknowledge him and ask him to help us to get there. Yeah. So what's the latest movie about? And tell us a little bit about who's starring in it. Well, this is the story of uh, Margie and Patrick, and in their uh, real life, they fell madly in love in school, and it was first love. And then you know how things go on. They graduated, they moved 3,000 miles apart, and it all slipped away. But they always carried that memory right there in their hearts about their first love. Neither of them thought there was any possibility, any hope of a second chance. And then through amazing God wakes that began to unfold 15 years later, they had an encounter that taught them that second chances are possible. And because this is a real movie, a real story, we have to realize that there are real possibilities and real hope for second chances in our own lives. Well, everybody wants to know that, don't they? Yeah. <laughs> There's also, a, I understand, a 1966 Ford Fairlane that stars in this movie. Tell us about that. Well, it is a snazzy car, yeah. <laughs> that was the car that Patrick <clears throat> had when he was in high school. And his mother kept it in the garage in perfect condition. And that is the car where he was driving down a highway when all of a sudden Marjorie, his old flame that he hadn't seen in many, many years, sees this car and says, oh, my gosh, that looks like the car we used to drive in all the time to the games, to the prom. And then she looks over. That looks like Patrick's car. That is Patrick. Wow, what a so, God wink. So <laughs> she's beeping her horn. They, so it was really the car that brought them together that she yeah. noticed that. And they pulled over and they started talking. And it was just, it was like no time had passed. 
So you see, the car was a God wink link, <laughs> bringing them together. Exactly. <laughs> you know, you talked a little bit earlier about people loving Hallmark movies because they do show families coming together and a time when, when the world was a bright and happy place. There's so much division in our country right now as we head into this holiday. Do you think that looking back and reflecting on the way it used to be could be uh, sort of a link, if you will, to enjoying life in a different way than we know it right now? Yeah. Yes, I think so. And you know, first of all, God winks when they happen to us are like a steady handrail on a wobbly staircase. Mm -hmm. So we are on a wobbly place mm -hmm. right now in our whole world, our whole nation. And so we are looking for a steady handrail. Mm -hmm. And that handrail of God is reaching down to us. We just have to open our eyes and to see his presence in our lives. And those God winks that happen all the time are how we see his presence. We realize he's right next to us. And you know, here we're celebrating the holiday season and God winks really are like little gifts left on your doorstep. You have to open the door and open your gift. Yeah. God has God winks for everyone. And so many people will ask us, well, well, how do I get God winks? And, you know, there's, there's a wonderful, I think it was a, a William Temple. William and, Temple, Sir William. Yes. He was a sir. Yes. And what did he it say? Was in 1650, he said, when I pray, coincidences happen. When I don't, <laughs> they don't. Now, of course, we can't blame him. He didn't use the word God wink at the time. It wasn't quite invented yet. <laughs> but if you pray and really seek God, he will give you these little signs of assurance that you're not alone. It's like a person-to-person -person call just for you with him saying, hey, kid, I know what you're going through. I know where you are. I'm, I love you, and I'm going to help you. Yeah. He really wants us to spend that time with him. Well, we want all of you to know that you must see this holiday viewing. The movie is called A God Wink Christmas, Second Chance, yeah. First Love. You can watch it yeah. on on Hallmark. Is, am I saying that right? Yeah, A God Wink Christmas. You can watch it on Hallmark Movies and Mysteries Channel. That's on Sunday, November the 22nd at 10 p.m. Eastern Time. So that'll start your holiday season off on the right foot. We love having Squire and Louise with us. Thanks to both of you. All right, Terry. Great to see you. Merry Christmas. Yeah, Merry Christmas <laughs> to you. Happy Thanksgiving first. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs>